Hello, welcome back to my channel. I'm Tori Sterling. Um, and you just won a million dollars. It's 6.26 in the a.m. I'm supposed to be meeting my mom in four minutes to go work out. So um, let's see if I actually get there on time. I've never gotten there on time to meet my mom to hang out. Just because like this gym that I go to, there's no easy way to get there. Like it's on, like it's the next town over from me and it's on like a, a weird side of it. Like I don't really know how to explain it. There's just like, there's no easy way to get there from my house. I just got back from Florida and it was nice to have like a little vacay, but I don't even know if it was a vacay because I went to Disney. So it was like go, go, go every second. So I kind of feel really exhausted. All right, I'm just gonna put the camera away because I'm just like babbling on at this point. So um, I'll see you guys at the gym. workout do you guys like how I did that or do you want it more like a montage sort of just like not really telling you what I do just sort of like showing you I don't know let me know what you guys really like um, but yeah that's what we did I'm just filling up my car now with gas because when I leave on trips I'm like oh I'll just do everything when I get back and then I have so much to do when I get back home so whatever because of that I also have no food I feel like in all my vlogs I'm like I have no food but like I don't have food so I'm gonna grocery shop today I'll show you guys what I get, but because I don't have food, my mom is going to make me food because my mom's an angel, so I'm going to her house. I don't know what she's going to whip up. I'm not even sure what I'm, like, in the mood for, but, um, that's the move right now. Breakfast is served. So it's eggs, nutritional yeast, cauliflower, asparagus, and then roasted veggies that my mom made last night. Yep. What's in the veggies? Sweet potatoes, um... Broccoli, cauliflower, asparagus, yellow peppers, onions, corn. And I grilled some ears of corn and then chopped them off and put them in there too. The corn makes it. I don't know if you can, you can't really, you can't even tell, but um, around me it's just like a mess, like a freaking mess. And I don't know if I'm going to have time to clean it today because I'm packing so much into my day that I just don't know if cleaning up up here will make it. So tomorrow morning might have to be like a cleaning day because I can't live like this. I mean, I'd love to do it today, but I have like too much other stuff to do today. I just realized that I'm really lazy. Like a lot of the times I'll be like, oh, I have to do this. I'll do it later, but then like I never do it. I'm getting my eyebrows done today at 4.30, thank God, because they need to be done. I have some laundry going right now. Um, I'll probably make a smoothie in a little bit. My mom sent me this article the other day that was like, why smoothies are bad for you, and now I'm kind of like worried about a smoothie. So what do you guys know or think? Because like pretty much that whole reasoning was like you eat way too much food and you aren't aware of how much food you're eating. Which makes like perfect sense when you think about it. Because when you eat a smoothie, you're eating like two bananas, spinach, like apples, a whole thing of berries. Like you're eating so much food. But because it's already like grinded up and like liquidized for you, your body doesn't have to do as much work. So it kind of just sits there and it doesn't really do anything good for your body. 
which makes like perfect sense because when your body has to work a little bit harder to like um, absorb the food and stuff it will get the nutrients a little bit better and it will work a little bit harder and you can like you it works on your metabolism but with that it's already kind of done for you so I mean it does make perfect sense but I just love smoothies I find that when I take time for myself to like get myself ready and to get my day started and just take me time, I find that I'm much more productive all throughout the day because I kind, I don't know, like enjoying how I look really helps and you know, getting dressed for the day, even though I'm gonna probably not even leave my house until I have to go get my eyebrows done or maybe grocery shop or something, just getting dressed and out of like workout clothes really helps me a lot. So um, I really don't have food to even make a smoothie. The only thing that I can make right now is oatmeal and I'm really hungry so I'm gonna make some. Like it's not the ideal thing that I wanna have right now. I'd really rather be having like a smoothie but um, I don't wanna go grocery shopping until I like edit my video and do a couple things around the house. So I'm not going to shop quite yet. But I showed you guys how I make this oatmeal in my last fitness video. So I will link that below because this is like my favorite oatmeal ever. And it's so good. But tonight I am going to make this one thing that I saw on Instagram. Nourished by Kale posted it. And it just looked so good. It was like sweet potato with avocado and like yogurt on it. And like, oh my God, it looked so amazing. All right, like I said, not ideal, but you know what? It's gonna do. Now I have to go switch some laundry and edit a video before I can do any grocery shopping. You're leaving your bubble so i just curled my hair now i'm gonna film a sorority rush video um all about like recruitment and my experience my tips my advice everything like that so yeah i'm gonna film that real quick filmed and i've like barely eaten today like i just had some carrots and hummus right before i left like four of them <laughs> four of them four but i'm just not hungry today like that oatmeal that i had just like filled me up like i am so full so i'm on my way to get my eyebrows waxed and i'm just in like some gym attire because i'm just gonna go to spin right afterwards um i'm wearing the same sports bra that i wore this morning because i did my laundry and i was like you know what i was feeling my sports bra so i wore it again and um yeah my sports bra is from lulu my shirt excuse you my shirt is jimbley and my pants are Lulu. They're my favorite. They're the, the the fast and the free. They're so amazing. But I'm not gonna vlog and drive, so I'll be back. I just got my eyebrows waxed, and I always look like like a dried little rodent. I'm like so sensitive around my eyebrows, so I I brought some makeup with me because I knew that I'd have to cover it up. I think a beauty blender blends out eyeshadow. I guess today we're gonna find out. All right, so it's only 4.45. Honestly, I thought I would have so much, like, less time. But I don't just want to, I don't want to drive home because as soon as I get home, I'd have to, like, turn back around to go to spin. So maybe I'll just, like, go to Wegmans and get some food or something. Hopefully, that's enough. <clears throat> I think I'm just going to run into, like, Wegmans. <clears throat> And get food or something? I don't know. I'm hungry. Maybe I'll just eat it in my car. I think I'll go get Wegmans. Okay, so I got some fruit and granola. I'm just gonna eat this before a spin. And then I'm gonna grocery shop right after a spin. I know I suck because this is like all a car vlog, but I just got done spin and now I am at uh, Wegmans and I'm gonna grocery shop real quick. A bachelorette is on in like 30 minutes. So this is like a power hour 
uh, grocery thing real quick. Honestly, I just want to give a quick shout out to Shoshana though because she is the owner of Soul Beat. I talk about Soul Beat all the time. That's where I teach my spin classes. You guys know this. She, I just took her class. It was incredible. Like I haven't had a feeling from a class like that I just had in such a long time and it was just amazing. It was probably because I took like a week off um, because I was away, but it was just so amazing of a class, the vibe, the energy. It was like, it was amazing. It reminds me exactly why I love spin and it was just, I hope everyone experiences something like that once in their life because it's amazing. But okay, I gotta go. Okay, here's all the goods. Let's do a little grocery haul. I told you this was like a mega trip. I was like in and out in like 15 minutes. It was great. So I'm back up peanut butter, a cantaloupe because it's melon season, baby. Um, this is a cucumber. This is a zucchini. Two peaches. I used to love peaches. Um, there was always this little, that's my dryer, there was this little stand that was right by my house and we'd always drive by it and we'd get a bunch of peaches. So this like makes me happy. Okay, my dryer needs to shut up. Um, I got three lemons, three sweet potatoes. The selection was horrible so I kind of hope I still have some in the fridge. But I'm going to make some Marissa veggies and this amazing sweet potato thing that I saw tonight for dinner and I cannot wait. Oh my god, shut up. Apples, uh, two avocados. The selection was horrible, so I had to get these super green ones. Spinach, one head of broccoli, because I don't know if I have broccoli or not, but um, I'll be fine with one head until I get more. Um, yogurt, this is for the sweet potato thing. I, again, don't know if I have yogurt. This was so on the fly. Ice cream, because while I was in Florida, all I was craving was ice cream, because it was hot. And I saw everyone eat ice cream, and I wanted ice cream, so I bought ice cream. Blueberries, raspberries, chopped onions. This just saves so much time for me, and I really like it like this. These grapes look too amazing to pass up, so I got some red seedless grapes. Strawberries, two bunches of bananas, chips, and um, they didn't have the eggs that I like, so I got these, and I don't know, I'm kind of iffy about them. Honestly, I should have just waited until um, I could get eggs from Diane. She's a client at Solby and she raises eggs or she raises chickens and she always gives us her eggs. So I should have just asked her for another one, but I was in a pinch and I was like, you know what, I'll try these. But if I crack one open and the yolk isn't like that darker color, I think I'm just going to have to throw it all away. We will see. But yeah, this is the grocery haul. Okay, so with the veggies, I just cut up um, sweet potatoes, broccoli, cauliflower, and then I can't have chickpeas. You guys have all like seen this before. I'm just sprinkling some olive oil on. These aren't like the sweet potatoes I was like telling you guys about. I'll show you that in one sec, but I'm just putting a little olive oil on these, and then some garlic salt. And then that goes in the oven for 15 minutes on each side. Okay, so these potatoes I just like sliced up as you can tell. And then I take coconut oil. This is just like spray on coconut oil. It just makes your life so much easier. Some cinnamon. And then this is Himalayan pink salt. Sprinkle that on there. And you put them in the oven at 350 for 35 minutes. and you turn it halfway through. So my veggies are done. I'm just waiting for these to finish up and then I'll show you how I finish that. But I'm just gonna eat these in the meantime. Okay, so they're like ready enough, um, I hope anyway. Some yogurt, this is the So Delicious Dairy Free made with coconut milk. It's my personal favorite. Some peanut butter. Somebody want done. Well, the years start coming and the don't stop Cacao nibs. Ooh, ooh. And a drizzle of agave. Okay, let's hope it's good. It's good. So it's actually the next day. Last night after I ate that, I just watched The Bachelorette and I like fell asleep on the couch and I woke up this morning. So yeah, um, it's like 11.05 right now and I have my lunch crunch that I'm teaching in like 45 minutes or so. Well, it's at noon, so it's in like 55 minutes. So I'm going to end the vlog here. I hope you guys all enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to give it a 
thumbs up and let me know what other kind of stuff you guys want in my fitness vlogs um i have a lot of ideas for like topics to do like i want to do like a 10 tips to get healthy and all that sort of stuff so let me know if you guys would be interested in that but um yeah i hope you guys all have a great day if you guys want to see my last video that's right here and um i love you guys so much bye